Well, nearly two months after the killing of a Jewish community leader in Detroit, police have a new person of interest in custody. But the deadline for investigators to charge the person or let them go is now fast approaching. News Nation's Rich McHugh is live in Detroit. Uh, so, Rich, what more are you learning about the case? Hi, Kelly. So we're... It's been four, it's been 52 days since since Samantha Wool was murdered, brutally murdered in the apartment complex behind me. It's been nearly 48 hours since a person of interest was arrested and taken into custody. Now, under Michigan law, they have 48 hours to arrest or release this person of interest. Police have not given us any details about this person of interest. It's been almost impossible to get information out of the police, but they did give us this statement from the chief. I want to read it. The public must understand that in the context of complex homicide investigations, it is not unusual for there to be a number of suspects, persons of interest, investigative leads, and evidentiary follow-ups that must be thoroughly examined before investigators are ready to submit a warrant to the prosecutor. Office. In this case, new evidence surfaced with respect to this particular person of interest that necessitated their arrest at this time. At no time was the community in danger, as this person of interest was under continuous investigation. The person of interest was taken into custody within an hour of new information surfacing because investigators were familiar with their whereabouts. Now, friends that I've spoken to here in town, here in Detroit, friends of Samantha Wolf, are beyond frustrated with the, the, the pace that the Detroit Police Department is taking with this investigation. I spoke to one of her friends earlier, Sam Dubin. Take a look. It is frustrating. It's it's almost agonizing, and we understand that they don't want to compromise their investigation, but they've been very, very tight-lipped. Um, at least keep us in the loop, provide press conferences, perhaps, so that we can ask questions, the press can ask questions. And, and really, if you can't answer something, of course, that's understandable. Um, but again, sunlight is the best disinfectant, and we truly believe that. So we, of course, are appreciative of the police. We know that they're on our side, and that is why we so want them to keep us in the loop uh, in their investigation. So just, so just to reiterate, person of interest in custody, the deadline for 48 hours is approaching. Police are tight-lipped. So we, we will see what they say if they charge this person or release him soon, Callie. All right. Certainly want to keep eyes on Rich McHugh. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.